Broadcasting from the business capital of the world, this is the Podcast Business News Network. Welcome back to the show, Daryl Bumpus Sr. joining us here live on the podcast, also on the Zoomcast. Uh, yeah, you may know him as the CEO of his own company, best-selling author, uh, speaker, life coach, and so much more. Let's welcome him back to the show. How are you today? I'm great, Jill. I'm, I'm above ground. I'm winning. I'm breathing. I'm winning. How are you? I'm doing fantastic on this beautiful spring day here in New York. Uh, Atlanta, Georgia, it must be hot, but uh, I got to tell you, we've been talking for weeks and I finally get to see you here live on Zoom and I'm so excited because I just feel so much more connected. We need to talk. Yeah, that's one of your books uh, amongst <laughs> others we're going to get to. But let me have you first just tell, tell everyone a little bit about yourself and what you do. Well, Jill, uh, I'm a uh, certified life coach. I'm a best-selling author. And I'm a self-investment uh, expert. In a nutshell, I help people get out of their own way. Mm -hmm. And a lot of us uh, could <laughs> use some of your help. And just to point out right off the top, what is your website? How do we reach you? My website is uh, DarylBumpusSenior.com. Perfect. And I mean, you have lots of experience, uh, lots to you. Where did you want to start? Well, I would like to start uh, our previous episode we left off on uh, well, several episodes ago, we discussed uh, self-improvement, self-help, uh, self-care, self-love. And I wanted to, once we got everyone on board with that, uh, and as I tell all my clients, and I speak to most of my clients and to audiences when I do my speaking engagements, that the two questions I ask them is, that, what are your goals and what are your distractions? Yeah. So we can't reach our goals until we eliminate our distractions, right? So after we are able to reach our goals, what's next? And how do we reach our goals? So we went through that 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 strategy and that blueprint of reaching our goals. So what's next? What do we do next? But I want our listeners to concentrate on right now. And someone out there needs to hear this. I want you to start thinking about Financial freedom, freedom, financial literacy, mm -hmm. uh, being able to get off the struggle bus, right, Jill? Yeah. Being able to uh, have that that flexibility with your own time, and being able to enjoy your family. How do we accomplish this, Jill? How do we accomplish this, Daryl? That's what our listeners are asking. That's what our audience is asking. So, this year, what I did is I released my new book. You need an income, not a job. Yeah. You need an income, not a job. Available at my website, DarylBumpusSenior.com and Amazon.com. You can invest in your in yourself and in the book. You need an income, not a job. Stop waiting and start creating. Mm -hmm. What we of us are waiting for someone else to yep. determine our destiny. Right, Jill? Mm -hmm. Exactly. Got to yeah, do it ourselves. Someone like you, you didn't wait. I always call Jill and, and her father. I'm piggybacking off her father, I'm taking a cue from her father. Oh. Always calls Jill the go getter. She is the yeah. go getter in the family, Good right? Memory, yeah. Right, uh -huh. right. <laughs> so I want to start creating the go getters, our listeners, our audience to become go getters in your life. Start creating multiple streams of income, start creating passive income. And how do we do that? And, and, and what are those incomes we can start creating? Yeah. One of my favorites is you can create an ebook. You can publish an ebook where you will have funds after people download your book, you will have funds deposited into your account via KDP, Kindle okay. Pub uh, Direct Publishing, right? Wow. Uh, you can also become a, uh, uh, an affiliate where that you can create, uh, have products that people will purchase from your website, from your YouTube page. Um, we're gonna touch on YouTube also. You can create, become a, an affiliate, but every time someone purchases the product, you will actually receive commission from that. So that's, that's number two. Number three, let's uh, say you can become a investor rental okay. properties yeah yeah 
a lot of people with the, the pandemic, a lot of people have, the pandemic have created a lot of entrepreneurs. Mm -hmm. A lot of people realizing their worth, what their worth is. Now, by no means as I, that I'm suggesting or recommending anyone to go out and quit their day job. Okay. That's not what I'm recommending. Mm -hmm. What I am suggesting is that you start creating multiple streams of income. Okay. And some people may feel that it's hard to do, and it's really not that hard. Mm -hmm. There are so many of us that watch YouTube for 24 hours a day almost, it seems like. We go and we look, look on one uh, YouTube video. We may come and watch uh, Jill on uh, doing the news or something like that to the effects of that. And now we're in a rabbit hole and we're watching so many other things. Just think about creating a live stream on YouTube. Some people may be able to create a uh, self-improvement, self-hope, motivational, motivational live stream. Mm -hmm. Some people may be able to create a uh, jazz music live stream. Mm -hmm. Believe it or not, one of the most very popular live streams is hymns from the Bible. That generates so much of traffic. Well, all you have to do is create the live stream, um, end up uh, going to a, a server, and this is pretty, the steps are so simple where that you can create your live stream and on the 21st, I don't know if they changed it or not, but on the 21st of every month, if your live stream is doing very well, you'll start receiving deposits, Ooh. making money while you sleep. Not <laughs> and bad all you have thing. to do is create the live stream, right, Joe? Yeah. Yeah. So there are so many, uh, so many ways, uh, as I uh, mentioned previously, is creating real estate. Maybe you're not creating real estate, but investing in real estate. Maybe you just want to do a, uh, a REIT. Maybe you just want to join a real estate group, a real estate community where you become a silent partner and you start uh, receiving dividends uh, from that investment, right? Someone else is doing the heavy lifting for you, but you are receiving the, uh, the dividends from the real estate. Maybe you want to uh, go out and purchase uh, some rental properties and you will go in and, and be able to collect or have deposits made into your accounts. Yeah. And nowadays, it is so easy to create rental properties yeah. and you don't even need to be a well-established investor. So here's, here's a little uh, secret or, or maybe something that people can look at and think that they can invest in real estate. There's a program called a DSCR mm -hmm. program. DSCR, they are they give you DSCR is called is uh, acronyms of DSCR is debt service coverage ratio. I hope I'm pronouncing it correctly, okay. but debt service coverage ratio. So what these companies do is, if you have an entity and it doesn't take long to create an entity, uh, it takes you maybe. 15 minutes if you want to do it on your own. If not, you may go to several other sites and they will do it for you, such as LegalZoom, Fiverr.com, several other sites that are created for you. Uh, after you create your entity, the DSCR companies will give you a loan according to no. what the rent is for that property. So all you need is a entity uh, LLC, uh, if the, if you have an LLC, you have an entity, all you need also is a maybe a 20% down payment. But if you have a first year, first time investor, they may require a 25% down payment. Some of these uh, DSCR companies will even loan you up to anywhere. The minimum could be 75000 up to well over 200000 a million, you know in some cases. But I'm just giving you several examples on how you can create multiple streams of income, passive income. Um, someone like myself, you may be able to sell a course. There's so many of our listeners out there and viewers that have 
a wealth of knowledge. A wealth of knowledge. I can imagine if people was to say, someone was to say, well, Jill, how do I get into media? Yeah. Yeah. Jill has so much information <laughs> on the journey and the steps she took to get to the position that she is in now that she can actually create a course. Right now, I'm just sitting here and just talking to me, telling me her journey will give people an insight and a blueprint on how to get into media. Absolutely. Media. Yeah. And then become a coach. I could become a, a, a broadcasting journalist coach. Absolutely. You know, the, the, the best thing, not the best thing, but one of the things a lot of people are, are tapping into now is you mentioned a coach consulting, just consulting, just coaching someone on how to be uh, um, uh, get involved in the media, uh, consulting someone on what it would take. So a consulting uh, um, or a coach, mm -hmm. these are, again, multiple streams of income, passive incomes. Yeah. So people may ask, well, what is the what is the number one? What is the, the number amount of multiple streams of income you should have? Great question. Yeah. But my answer to that is there is no number. Mm. There is no numbers. Most people will suggest that you should have at least five streams of income. I suggest that you have what you are capable of, what you can handle. Because let's just say if you have maybe five and you're not able to give the focus to one or two or three or four, and you can't focus on that many, then you're actually just wasting time. Mm -hmm. What I've learned is that uh, grinding, people say that I'm, you're busy and people say that they're grinding. They're in the, they're in the grinding mode. But what my mentor taught me years ago is that grinding is activity. Yeah. Focus is productivity. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let me just repeat that for our listeners. Grinding is activity. Yeah. Focus is productivity. So when you're grinding, you're just moving around. You're like that hamster, that gerbil in, in, the, uh, in the wheel, just moving and moving, not going anywhere. But with focus, you see productivity and things will start to manifest for you. So that's the difference between grinding and uh, focus. So again, I would suggest that you invest in, you need an income, not a job. You need an income, not a job. Stop waiting, start creating available at amazon.com and DarylBumperSenior.com. Oh, I love it. I love it. You're so good. Look at you. You're like ready for the break. We're zooming. There's no commercial break, but I did need to ask, you know, the best form and all forms of contact for you. And of course, where can we get your books? And I say books plural because you have more than the, um, the one he showed. <laughs> you need, yeah, you need an income, but there's also other books. Uh, do you want to share a little bit about that before we continue? Sure. All of my, my books, I have uh, five bestsellers. And you can find them on Amazon.com or DarylBumpusSenior.com. Awesome. Uh, I challenge our viewers, our listeners, if you are ready to get off the struggle bus, mm -hmm. you are ready to get out of your own way, the struggle bus. You like that? Yeah, I love that. Uh -huh. <laughs> if you are ready to get off the struggle bus, if you are ready to get out of your own way, if you are ready to find a peace of mind, if you are ready to find happiness, yeah. I guarantee that I will change your life. I guarantee you I will change your life. There's a record by Mumford and Sons and I'm paraphrasing, but it says, lend me your eyes and I will change what you see. So if you're ready to do all those things, I would suggest that you contact me at 404-423-6536. 404-423-6536. 
DarylBumpusSenior.com. And you can find me on social media platform, Daryl Bumpus Senior. Awesome. 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 <laughs> I mean, the work you're doing, by the way, you are a certified uh, life coach as well, motivational speaker, uh, just to point out. I mean, you've been lots of places and speaking to amazing crowds and look how you do it. I mean, all your forms of income, you've got it figured out. And it's like, here's your blueprint. Look up to him. Look, he's going to give you advice, obviously, with what you're going through. But he can also walk you through the steps, the processes he took to get to where he is. It's the same concept. And I use me as an example before. But hello, you are the example yourself, uh, Mr. Bumpus Sr. Um, <laughs> and, you know, the work you're doing. I mean, you also mentioned uh, investing in yourself, right? And producing more income. So it's it's a mindset, right? I mean, there's a lot to the mindset. You mentioned manifestation before as well. How do you work with your clients one on one, coaching them? I mean, there's accountability. Uh, you know, how many times do you meet with them though? And just give us, yeah, some examples of the people that you're working with or have worked with and the successes that they've had. Just um, thanks to you. Well, great question, and thank you for that, Jill. Well, I work with my clients. What we do first is we come up with a strategy. And a lot of times my clients come to me, someone that may be dealing with uh, distractions in their life. They may be in the middle of a, a, a transformation. Uh, they may be in the middle of, of uh, switching jobs, uh, changing careers, um, maybe even relocating to a different state. And they just have some fears. And fear, fear can cripple us. Fear can be contagious at times. So what we do is we come up with a strategy and we figure out how they are able to get out of their own way. I keep reiterating this, 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 this statement, getting out of your own way, but it just means so much. And a lot of people don't really understand it because their comfort zone is usually lying to them. How do you know that you're in a comfort zone until you expand and leave that comfort zone? So I challenge them by trying to reintroduce them or introduce them to new things. And a lot of times what I like to practice with them is uh, I like to call it confidence muscle. You have to practice using your confidence muscle. And I'll give you just a really simple step. Let's just say you go into your bathroom. And a lot of times this is the homework that I use with my clients. You go into the bathroom and you turn the water on to hot water. Not too hot where it's going to scold yourself. So full disclaimer, I don't want anyone to scold themselves. Yes, be careful. <laughs> <laughs> but I just wanted to wear a little uncomfortable for you as soon as you put your feet in it or your toe in it. And I want you to get put both feet in the bathtub where it's uncomfortable for you, where you your first reaction is to retreat. Your first reaction is to flee. Now, I want you to understand Floyd Mayweather heavyweight, not heavyweight, but a, a, a boxing champion, one of his favorite quotes that I ad adopt is champions can adapt to anything. So while you're in that bathtub and you're feeling like you're ready to flee, I want you to say to yourself, this is nothing. This is nothing. I can adapt to this. I can adapt to this. And before you realize it, not only your feet are in the water, you are submerged in the bathtub because you have gotten comfortable. You have adapted to the situation. You have adapted to the situation. Another piece of homework I like to give my clients is what I call mirror work. So for 10 minutes, in the morning or in the evening, stand in front of the mirror and we discuss investing, self-investment, self-love, self-improvement, and talk to yourself. Do the mirror work. Say to yourself, I am 
I will, I can. I am, I will, I can. Yeah. And let's do this for 21 days straight. Okay. 21 days straight so that it sinks in so much so that it becomes normal for you. Mm -hmm. So that when things are getting uncomfortable in your life, when life shows up and throws a gut shot at you, we can understand that. We relate to that. I spoke to Jill previously mm -hmm. about watching my father take his last breath from dying from cancer mm -hmm. yeah. and, and, and her mother being she, there, yep. watching her mother pass away also. So we've experienced heartache. So just in case you're thinking, well, it's easier for you to say, it's easy for Jill to say, we have been through some hard times in our life. And that's why today we are here to say that whatever you're going through is temporary. Mm -hmm. Whatever you're going through is temporary. Champions can adapt to anything. So the way that you adapt is practice your mirror work. I am, I will, I can. Mm -hmm. So even if you're in the traffic, you know, we all love that New York traffic. We all yep. love that that uh, uh, Georgia, that Atlanta traffic. Mm -hmm. Of course, <laughs> right? And when you find yourself becoming stressed, yeah. it's temporary. Okay. It it's is. temporary. Yeah. But you also adapt. Mm -hmm. You can also adapt. Mind over matter for sure. <sighs> yeah, mind over matter. Mind over matter. So when no one else is around to encourage you, mm -hmm. you have to be able to encourage yourself. You have to be able to encourage yourself. I am, I will, I can. Yep. So working with my clients, these are some of the tools that I share with them and help them uh, become the best version of themselves. Because in that moment, the reason it came to me is because they are asking a question. And one of my favorite quotes again is the Celestine prophecy. The problem in life isn't finding the right answers. Mm -hmm. It's identifying the right questions. Yeah. Once you get the questions right, the answers will always come. But most importantly, you have to remain alert. You have to remain alert. So most of my questions, my clients are coming to me because they have questions in their lives about where they're going. So I'm, as I describe to most of my clients is that I'm the bridge from your present to your future. <laughs> I love it. And, uh, I have the honor and the privilege to witness their journeys and help them uh, accomplish their journeys and their goals. Beautiful. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful, the work you do. Guys, if you're just listening, tuning in, Daryl Bumpus Sr. joining us here today, our, our life coach, our, I'm going to call you a spiritual advisor too, because you got something going. He's an author, uh, world-renowned speaker, and best-selling author, and he's here helping so many. Um, you really invest in yourself and to really live a better life, but not all of us have the tools how to do it, and he could guide you through with the process, um, and I know you've worked with many people, um, and we still have, oh my gosh, we got only three three minutes left. How did that happen? It always goes so fast, That's even in person. Oh, okay, just, what else did you want to add? This is what happened. I'm so sorry. What else did you want to add for today? Uh, so I just want to say to, again, to all of our, our listeners, someone needs to hear this. Mm-hmm. It's not by mistake that you came on the show and you you found us and you found Jill. You probably was looking for Jill and I was, I'm lucky to be hey, here. No, no. So, no, no. <laughs> but I want to say to you, and I really want you to understand this and, and I really want you to listen, that again, everything you are going through, mm -hmm. 
everything you're going through, everything you have experienced is preparing you for something that is about to blow your mind. And I'm speaking from experience. Mm -hmm. If you think about the times in your life, mm -hmm. every cer certain amount of days, a certain amount of years, there is pivotal moments. Mm -hmm. So what you are going through right now is preparing you for a shift, a shift in your life. So my question that I pose to our listeners is that the universe is shifting. You have to decide, are you going to be on the recovery side or the discovery side? And the discovery side is becoming the new you, the best version of yourself. What side are you going to be on? I wish you all the success that is coming to you. But I dare you, I dare you to get off the struggle bus. I dare you to step into your blueprint. I dare you to step into your greatness. I dare you to contact me at 404-423-6536, darylbumpersenior.com. I dare you to invest in my books at amazon.com. I wish you all the success that is coming to you. And get off that struggle bus. I love it. <laughs> Daryl, thank you so much for being here, for joining us, guys. Pick up a copy of this book. Go to the website. Uh, also, uh, social media, we can find you where? Um, I uh, Instagram, Facebook, LinkedIn, TikTok, all social media platforms. Perfect. Again, Daryl, D-A-R-R-Y-L-B-U-M-P-A-S-S, -S, Senior SR. Check them out. Thank you so much. Great seeing you today. Looking forward to our next show and our conversation. As always, a pleasure. And I'm liking the Ralph Lauren polo. Have a great day, okay? We'll talk soon, sweetheart. Thank you. Are you looking for even more of the podcasts and hosts that you love? The Podcast Business News Network is proud to announce that you now have even more ways to listen live. Check out the MyTuner Radio, Online Radio Box, and Simple Radio apps on iOS and Android, or find us online. Search for Business News Network on mytuner-radio.com or search Podcast Business News Network on streama.com and onlineradiobox.com slash US. Take your podcast on the go and don't miss a minute of the action. Broadcasting from the business capital of the world, this is the Podcast Business News Network. For nearly 2,000 severely injured veterans, everyday life has become filled with barriers. Day-to-day -day simple tasks can become pretty daunting. I have to carry my chair up two flights of steps or have somebody do it for me. What scares me the most is just the falling. When I'm struggling with my house, I think, you know, to have that one great barrier just knocked down, I mean, it's, it's crucial. Home for Our Troops is a wonderful nonprofit that builds a mortgage free, fully adaptive, handicap accessible house, and there's no catch. It'll be our very first home that we've ever owned. This is a game changer. This is where your life begins again. We need you to join us in completing this important mission. Please visit hfotusa.org and help build homes and rebuild lives. Because of you, everything's going to be okay.